dinner right there. Salami. Probably got about a pound of salami. Big fucking fan. Well, what do we got in the store today? Um, the only way you could eat or drink is to work. Otherwise, you're getting disability, social security, and mooching off the government, which maybe one day I will. Yeah, I don't know. First in store in line is Peach A. Rita. It even has a gold cap on it. Pretty cool. I have a physical the 28th on Tuesday of this month. March 28th, I have a physical. I have to get a tetanus shot. Well, I don't have to get a tetanus shot. Then I take my blood doing a ran, uh, annual physical. and I haven't had a physical in over a decade. I'm like, I don't want to go. I'm scared they're going to give me bad news. I can tell me my liver is all messed up. Fuck. Cheers. Salute. Clock's in at 8%. Sometimes I wonder how much more you guys would enjoy me if I didn't, you know, do drinking videos. If you guys would actually, like, if I played the piano or just acted myself, if you guys would appreciate me more. This is like a kettle brand chip. I don't know if I'm gonna like it. Pretty good. They're um pepperoncini or something flavor. Or I can't pronounce the word. It's supposed to have like a, <coughs> a very subtle <coughs> spice. <coughs> have you guys ever? Sp spread a little peanut butter on a hamburger. I was just curious. These chips aren't cheap. They're one of your um, top shelves potato chips. Um, they come out of, I think, Oregon or Colorado. Kettle brand. Not bad. Um, Riz, I never live with a female. Um, I went to Piatta's today. I don't know if you guys have a Piatta's. It's like an Italian, Italian street food chain. Um, you go in there, you pick your pasta, or your, they got like breaded kind of style pizza. You pick your pasta, and I, I normally would typically today I went there. I spent ten bucks. It's expensive. I had the angel hair pasta, sweet marinara, calamari, um, numerous several vegetables. It was tasty. Um, shredded cheese on there, a little hot pepper, and it was pretty damn good. I mean, you pay what you, you know, get what you pay, right? Let's see what I'm gonna do. Let's see salami. Let's see, these are good tomatoes. What you do? Get you a little butter, right? Take, slap that salami on a sandwich whatever bread you fucking like. You nibble into that tomato, spread a little butter. I wish I had butter, but I don't put a little butter on there. Little Pringles, or chips, whatever, potato sticks. Potato sticks are good. Go to town. Slam dunk. Smash on it, you know. Yeah, and throw some cheese if you want. Salami cheese. The Italian. Italian dressing salami cheese. Even mayonnaise and bologna. I don't know. Fuck whatever. I'm done talking about I'm going to move forward, change the subject. Uh, try this. My mom's Italian, so I'm going to... She always gets Italian salami. Good salty flavor. It's got, my blood pressure is going to love me. Doing run errands today. Tomorrow, yeah, fuck, it's kind of late. I gotta be up. I'm gonna have trouble getting up in the morning after I drink. Heavy night of drinking, I have trouble waking up. And I feel shitty all the time. Um, I gotta be at work at 11 tomorrow. Normally, I go to work at 2.30 p.m. Tomorrow, I gotta be there at 11 a.m. 
they've been down on people and short staff lately, so had to work another, you know, extra. Let me, I'm gonna, after this sip, I'm going to touch on my last, my last subject. of it on my salami. What do we got in store? Got some, I see something down there, but I can't tell what it is. Something's in store. Check out of the box. Richard's Wild Rose. Whoa. Richard's Wild Rose. Huh. I'll be damned. New York. Anything out of New York I like. That's why I drink Genesee. What I want to talk about uh, is um, it takes you to another dimension. I am a different dimension. I ain't gonna snack. I'm gonna save my chips for later when I really get the munchies. Um, I want to touch on females, you know, recently I asked a couple older ladies out, they didn't, they declined, they rejected me, they shot me down because they, apparently they thought I was too young, but they said I'm a really nice guy, I have a good heart, I'm a nice person, and blah, 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 blah. I was like, okay, fine, I didn't push it any further, the mad or any further. Here's my, here's my, uh, take on this. I find old females in their 70s, 60s, even late 50s, early 60s. Let me tell you guys something. I'll tell you what. Females, girls in their 60s, 70s, even in the 80s can be hot as fuck. I've seen it. I've seen pictures of them for so many years. This ain't nothing new. I've known about this for freaking years. They're hot. Some of them are really pretty. <laughs> I tear that ass up. I really would. I'd let piss on me. It all depends on how a female takes care of herself. Age is nothing but a number. You could have a 70, 60 year old cougar or MILF cougar. They're hot as fuck. Or a gilf, grandmother. I love the fuck. A gilf. Hot as fuck. I would. Uh, shit. I'd, I'd go out with a 68 or 72 year old if she was sexy. Cheers to that. I know they're out there because I've seen pictures of them, and they they're, they make me horny, they turn me on, just because they're so sexy, and they have sexy, you know, sexy features, you know, I'm not going to, Just today I saw um, this dude, he was like in his 20s with a 70 year old, or at least 68, 70, 75, maybe 76 year old. She was fucking, I'd fucking have some sexual fun with her, hell yeah. And some chicks are just sexy, and they don't lose it with age. I mean, as they get old, you know, they have like wine. You get fine, finer with age wine, right? Yeah, I would, I would fuck, I'd even... Hell, I'd, if, if there was an 86-year-old that looked hot, I'd fuck her brains out. It's just me being honest. But, unfortunately, no hot chicks seem to like me. As a matter of fact, no one, period, seems to like me. No females show an interest in me. Maybe I really am a loser. I grew up wanting to be a basketball star and a I always thought I had good taste, and I thought I was born under a lucky star, but as I'm getting older, I'm realizing a lot of shit. Shit sucks. You know? Face the facts. Being realistic. Ain't, there ain't nothing. You know? They say drinking is a bad habit. I drink usually every night, but drinking isn't 
the ter most terrible thing in the world. I mean, people have been doing it since the times of Jesus. Yeah. Swell and chug, swell, swell, swell. Until next time, I'll see you on the flip, I think flip side. Uh, Blackmail Troy said it right, but I forgot what he said. Peace out.